Hello, welcome to the channel. I'm Sean. I'm Chris. And today we are brought here to check out 1OK Rock Renegades. Yeah. Um, like we just did a refresher on the couple songs that we do know by them, which is No Scared and the Standout Fit In. Yeah. Both epic songs in their own right, but can sound completely different. Um, yeah, completely different. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Um, we're a fan of a lot of Japanese rock, and 1OK Rock is one of the more famous bands over there we just never really got around to it down not that, yeah yeah that. not anything against them or anything like that like we generally prefer female vocalists for the most part um so that was like the first like wave and if you go into japanese rock like in female fronted bands then you got a long time before you see all the female fronted bands because there's, there's a lot, millions of them. There's a lot, um, and a lot of them are super, super talented. So you get down a whole bunch of rabbit holes. Well, long story short, we're trying to get caught back up now. Yeah, and it just recently came out. So, yeah, yeah, and the two songs that we do know by them, we like. It's not like oh, we're kind of iffy on them. Like they're jamming ass songs. So Renegades, I'm excited to check it out. Um, yeah, sounds cool. Um, uh, yeah, um, high hopes for it. You know, right? You better have fucking high hopes. No, I'm <laughs> um, but can you think of anything before we just hop right in? No, ready to check it out. Right. Well, if you are new here, hit subscribe. We notice and appreciate it. Think you're pretty cool if you do. Yeah, and leave a comment. We like to uh, read them and reply and click on stuff. Yeah, renegade. <laughs> I do like it when a band is willing to like stand up for a cause and like take a take, stance. Actually take a stance. Right. Yeah. Instead of always just trying to please everybody kind of thing. Um, as Play long the as, sense kind of as thing. As long yeah. as it doesn't get like too preachy. You know, like I get getting the message out there, but on a lot on all the stances that I've seen and hear, like I'm not really the problem. Don't yell at me about it. Don't try to make me feel bad. Empower me to help the cause, not make me feel bad about for the situation. You know? that, um, yeah. So I, I like that it's taking the empowerment approach and it's not just focusing on one thing. It's like there are a lot of things that need to be worked on. Let's start just by start by doing something. You know, yeah. it just something is better than nothing at a certain point. I'm the 
And he's a good singer too. Yeah. Yeah. You know, because I think a lot of people put like rock singers and like metal singers into like a bubble of not good singers, you know, like, um, but I think it takes like more talent to even do like metal singing and screaming and stuff. And a lot of people get credit for, you know, like you try to growl on fucking key. Yeah. You know, see how that works. Yeah. You rip you. your vocal cords uh, with, up. with projection. Yeah. You know, that's the other hard thing, but he has like a powerful voice just singing too. But, um, <clears throat> but yeah, like I said, um, earlier about the having a stand saying, you know, like it's kind of cool with that whole song. It was empowering for you to do whatever you, whatever your cause is. Right. Yeah. You know, it wasn't, you listen to it, it, like, wasn't it wasn't like, wasn't Oh, do you, this. You, exactly. Um, it was just do something. And that's cool. Um, cause everybody should do something. Um, just don't try to make me feel bad for the, I am doing something. So don't make right. me feel bad for the things that I'm not kind of situation because i think most civil-minded people are doing something even if it's just not buying into the problem that's doing something because i like there's a lot of things that like i am extreme on like i have like a dark kind of morbid sense of humor and everything and i i'm an atheist i don't believe in any kind of god i don't believe in souls i don't believe in a lot of things i'm kind of anti-political where i don't stand on either side i rather just try to side with civil liberty and expression of free or freedom of expression and things like that so be whoever you want everything it's like it's not that hard just to get along with people you know right. the average person you know you don't not be a terrible human being right you yeah. know it's not hard to hold a door open for somebody or somebody drops something to pick it up and return it to them and just be polite to people in general i mean it's not that hard to do it's yeah. i mean I, I get that there are extreme situations and everything like that if everybody is it's easier said than done to just be peachy to everybody i right. get that but um i'm glad that it was empowering and not preachy is what i'm getting at ultimately so but yeah it was super it was cool it was nice to have a stance nice to because if if you have if you have like a, a movement that doesn't have traction i'm sure the frustration is, is why can't anybody just talk about it you right, know, kind right. of thing. Um, and then, like, if you can see somebody that's a famous band or anything, it's like, fuck yeah, thank you. Finally, somebody is just talking Speaking about, about it. it. Yeah. Just, just so, some, just so we're having this conversation now. You know, yeah. kind of thing. Um, and that helps gain traction on your movement and things like that too. Because you had the best cause in the world, but if people won't just talk about it, it doesn't matter how logical it is. It's not going to go anywhere. Yeah. So it's kind of cool to put some brain power towards. Um, but can you think of anything to add before we get out of here? No, I'm glad we checked it out. Yeah, you know, it, was it was a cool. good empowerment song. Yeah. yeah, it was cool. Well, thanks for watching with us. See you next time. <laughs>